Hey what's up guys welcome to let's code in this video we are going to see how to install exam server in windows system so let's get started open your favorite browser type exam as you can see the first link from apachefriends.org click there As we are going to install the exam for windows so i'm going to click exam for windows now here as you can see 7.4.11 is the latest version available at the time of this video the when as soon as you click on exam for windows it will download the installation file now it will take some time as it's around 155 MB for the installation file so I will get back to you after the file has been downloaded so here as you can see the installation file for exam has been downloaded just go to the folder where the installation has been downloaded just double click the installation file Now there you will see a warning message don't worry just click ok it will not harm your PC just click next here make sure this each and everything is checked you click next here it is asking to choose a folder to install the exam as the default installation folder is C drive so I'm not gonna change this just click next the language preferences for the exam control panel provided here is English uh, by default I'm gonna choose English just click next make sure you uncheck this learn more about Vietnamese for exam and then click next then here it's saying setup is now ready to begin the installation for exam just click next now this will install the exam into your system so guys as you can see the exam has been successfully installed into windows now here it's asking the do you want to start the control panel now so after clinic after clicking finish now uh, of uh, the exam control panel will pop up so the exam has been successfully installed into our system so when I click start for the Apache server as you can see the Apache server has been initiated started and it's running start the MySQL database so here as you can see it's a windows security alert it's just asking to allow the access to run the MySQL database in your private network so yes allow the access that's it so let's check just go to your google chrome browser just type localhost there you go welcome to exam for windows 7.4.11 this is the localhost dashboard for uh, saying the apache server is running and if you want to the want to go to php my admin that is mysql database you just have to type instead of dashboard localhost slash php my admin There you go. This is the interface for PHP My Admin MySQL database. If you want to create a new database, just click New, type the database name, and just click Create. It will create a database for you. So, 
I hope you all guys understood how to install XAMPP in Windows and I hope this video was very informative to you all. Do subscribe, like, comment your thoughts and do share this video with your friends. Thank you guys for watching till end.